On today's show, we get a taste of Easter. Welcome to Savor the Flavor, where we try the foods that you don't have to, unless you want to. I'm your host, Stephen White. Here again with me is Crash Start. Go check our channel out. And again with me, Katrina, Man Cave co-star and wife. So, we are celebrating Easter here on the show. And what a better way to do that than to find all those unique little Easter candies. So we're going to eat some of the, the more unique candies out there. Some that look delicious, some questionable. Let's get to it. Okay, so first off, we have these dove eggs. Peanut buttery dove eggs. So they're trying to match the uh, Reese's peanut butter eggs that have come out over the recent years. Uh, so we're going to crack one of these open. And they have a hard shell, my God. Mm -hmm. Nice little yeah. cross section. Look at that. That's pretty nice. It smells like a peanut butter egg, which you'd expect. There's something about the peanut butter and the Reese's that's wholly unique to that. They're not really matching that. It's creamy. Yeah. I mean, no type of candy peanut butter ever, you know, matches a Reese's. So the Dove chocolate overpowers the taste of the peanut butter. Mm -hmm. Those Dove chocolate's so rich anyway. I mean, it's it's not bad by no means. I mean, Dove chocolate's really good. But I guess the, the peanut butter's not as great as a Reese's mm -hmm. would be. Next up, we have uh, Reese's peanut butter cream eggs. Now, what's different about these is you have those Reese's eggs, and they're like little Reese's cups. These are actually... Reese's eggs. Like they're shaped like a, one of the little Cadbury eggs. And as we said, Creamy. Reese's peanut butter are just so, so good. Are, are, are we ready to take a bite of this? Because yes. I am. I'm excited. Mm. Tastes like a Reese's. Do you want a Reese's, by God? Mmm. Look at peanut butter in there. This is good. If you like the, the regular Reese's eggs, they come in that little package, you know, and they look all oval. Then you'll dig this. For sure. <laughs> so now we have a Lint, a Lint, a Lindor chocolate. If, you, if you're familiar with the, uh, the Lint brand, you know that their chocolate is top notch. They have those little cordials and truffles. and But now they've created little eggs. Uh, I don't think they're filled with anything other than mm -hmm. what, chocolate, maybe? Probably. It doesn't like say that they were peanut butter. The Lindors are like always full of like this creamy chocolate. So, let's take a bite and find out. <laughs> mm. 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 That is, it's just straight chocolate. It doesn't have the creaminess that the truffles have. The cream is very velvety. Mm. As you can see, usually going with eggs, you're not going to go wrong. You're going to love it. <laughs> so far, so good. We're three for three on eggs. Can we continue the streak? We'll find out. Next! Next we have Oreo eggs. <gasps> what? But Oreo now has their own eggs because everybody has an egg now. And look at these. They come in their own special little package. I, I'm not really sure how much these cost or how much they'll run you where you're at. Um, but you're probably paying more for the package than you are the actual egg. Oh, crack that bad boy over. Oh, now look at that. It's like cookies and cream inside. That's ah! Awful. I killed it! <laughs> I was going to try and I killed it! I can still eat it, but oh my god, look what I did. I killed it. Well, you can see the cookies and cream are in there. It looks like a swan. Yep. Okay, well... Let's try it before I kill it anymore. <laughs> hmm. What was that about? You can't go wrong with eggs. It? It's like <laughs> solid cream, or not like solid, but like entirely cream. It's got the like level of sugar that you could OD on it, like a regular Cadbury cream egg. That's too much. There's a 
There's something going wrong, man. <laughs> you know, the, the cookie crunch is interesting, but the cream, not really that good. So, hey, look at that. Oreo proved me wrong. <laughs> they said, no, we're going to have a terrible egg. <laughs> now we get out of chocolate and we get into the fun stuff. So, on our quest for looking for uh, interesting Easter items, we found Mystery Peeps. Now, I'm not a fan of Peeps because it's just it's just sugar in a ball and it's just too much. But, in the spirit of Easter and them being mystery flavors, <laughs> I figured why not? We'll do it for you. You sons of... Alright, go ahead. Uh, what do we have? It's mystery flavor in a blue package, yeah. yet you know, there's really not any other indication other than blue. And nowhere on the box does it tell you what it is. So we don't know what they are, and we're not going to probably say exactly what it is. We're just having to guess through our own taste buds. Are they supposed to smell like the flavor? Because I'm smelling maple syrup. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> well, they're all but gone. they are sugary. I mean, it's just... Yeah, but there's that... They're so cute. That mapley. And there's little things of like colored glass, purple, and yeah, blue. Yeah, there's straight maple there. All right, let's All right, bite them. All I'm getting is maple. Yeah. Number one of three out of the mystery peeps. Tastes like maple syrup. So we're gonna say our guess: maple syrup peeps. <laughs> Okay, so now we have the next peep in the orange package, number two of three. Very fruity. It smells like that fruity bubble gum. All right, let's go. Well, it's definitely fruit. It tastes like Pop Rocks. There's something Does. nasty in mine. <laughs> this must be the zesty one. No, Isn't that's it? sour. <laughs> that's sour. <laughs> Sour fruit! So here we are with number three. The green and yellow package. And that nasty sour taste is still in the back of my tongue. Let me just share a thought. It, I used to have shower gel that smelt like this. <laughs> I'm not excited to eat it. Alright, um, let's go. This is a sour one. Mmm. Definitely lemon. Hell yeah. Ooh. That's lemon lime oh, already. God. That is it. Oh no. Bitter. And now we come to the Peace de Resistance. Oreo Peeps. Who knew such a thing existed? They combined Oreos with Peeps. We should have expected as much because Oreo mixes with everything now. So you get this uh, vanilla cookie with a pink center. Looks like Play-Doh. Is it? Yeah, is this going to be like Oh, it smells like Play-Doh. It's going to be like the sweet oh dish all over. Smell it. Stop making candy flavored Oreos because I don't like eating Play-Doh in between. It, it smells like, like Play-Doh. No, well, it smells like a sugar cookie. Yeah. It does have a play doh -y smell to it. If you know, if you grew up eating Play-Doh, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> now, prerequisite, we got a dunk. But, uh, do you just want to take a bite first and then dunk? I, no. <laughs> uh, okay. I I'm going to. I'm going to dunk first and then bite. Wow. That's like that super frosting you get on your cake and it's just a big glob. And you eat it, and it gives you that weird sensation in your mouth where it's like too sweet that it almost becomes numbingly sour. I mean, it would make sense that a Peep Oreos would taste like that considering Peeps are nothing but sugar. Mm -mm. You guys notice it has a sugar grit to it? Mm hmm. I think it was better with the milk. I'm not a fan. There's too much sugar going on here. Sugar! Diabetes right here on the show. Uh, well, there you have it. All the sugar that you ever wanted for Easter. 
And we're all going to need doctor visits now. <laughs> yes, indeed. You choose whether or not you want to go eat this mess. Guys, if there's anything you want us to try, if you see something out there in the world, let us know in the comments. Just say, hey, try this out. This looks fun. It might not be, but we'll try it anyway just for you and tell you if it was any good or not. Come on back next time and watch us eat some more good or terrible stuff. Whatever it may be. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. 